Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Green Water Fish. And today I just want to give you guys a quick update of this black moor. And if you remember 11 months ago, exactly 11 months ago, I uploaded a video on goldfish standards on moor or telescope goldfish. And here's a link of that video on the, the top right corner of this video screen. But if you take a look at the video and compare it to what she looks like now, she has grown significantly larger. Um, she is currently um, seven inches long, which is huge for her. Um, but I think she's only about one year or a year and a half old um, so far. So she's grown, grown quite a bit. And I know some of you guys have um, wondered what is the key of making goldfish grow um, fast and healthy? And there is actually no secret to this. The main things for proper goldfish growth is water quality. You can't have goldfish growth without clean, pristine water. You need to ensure that water, water changes is frequent enough to remove all the harmful uh, molecules and materials in the water. It's not just the nitrogen products that's uh, removed through water changes. You also remove growth inhibitor factors, which is hormone secreted by goldfish when they grow. Um, it's basically um, something that's, that tells other goldfish or even a goldfish um, that's secreting hormone itself that there's enough goldfish in here and there's a lot of a lot of them and there's not enough space for them if the concentration of that hormone is high. So that will inhibit their growth significantly. So water changes remove that as well. And lastly, um, water changes will also bring in a lot of minerals and um, other molecules and materials and elements that we don't even know that is crucial to goldfish health. So water changes, definitely. And the second thing for um, good goldfish growth is diet. Um, when the fish is young, especially in juvenile ages, before one year old, you want to ensure that a goldfish has high protein diet. Um, once the goldfish reaches maturity, um, they actually reach maturity in six months old or something, but once the goldfish grows a little older, you can decrease the protein um, percentage in the diet. Just because they're getting a little growler, they don't need as much protein in their diet and they can just do just as fine. Um, another thing that I noticed for perfect goldfish growth is space. Now you can do a lot of water changes and make the water pristine, you can feed them perfect diet, but the goldfish won't grow if they're confined to a, such a little space. For example, this container. Of course I don't keep my goldfish here, this is just a display container for me to film for you guys, but if you do keep that goldfish in here even though you change water every day and stuff, they won't grow because there's not enough space for them to turn around and swim. As you can see, she is so large that she can barely fit in this container. I'll make this video short because I don't want to stress her out. But um, if there's no space for them to swim around and for them to have space to do stuff that goldfish needs to do, they won't grow either. So ideally, you want to have a large space provided for them. Now she grown um, really, really fast in a 40 gallon tank. And after I move her to a 100 gallon top, she grown even larger. Now another thing you want to remember that is that goldfish usually grow the fastest during their first year and afterwards they just slow down. And if you want to stimulate the growth even more, you can up the temperature a little bit, but I don't recommend that because the higher the temperature it is, the higher the metabolism, although they will grow faster, but you will also shorten their life, um, which you may or may not want. Um, that's basically it. And I'm gonna just gonna show you guys some top view of this fish. Thank you.